time for the gloves. It is cold this morning. Hey, good morning folks, Jesse with Southern Reels Fishing and today I'm back out at the concrete ships and it is a crisp, cool, breezy Sunday morning. Air temperatures are in the 50s today, water temperatures have just hit 60. So we're going to go out here and try to catch some tall fish today. I have fiddler crabs with me and shrimp and I'll be using bottom sweeper jigs when the current is low and switching over probably to a double dropper loop, hand tie dropper loop setup with a two or three ounce weight, you know, when the current picks up because the heaviest bottom sweeper I have right now is a one out. Uh, be fishing the bottom, of course, because that's where the togs hang out, right up on structure. And if that doesn't work out for us, then we'll probably switch over and try to catch some trout, maybe up closer to shore. Anyway, that's what's up today. Wish us luck. Hopefully we get on some fish. Hello. Howdy. Are you Jess? Yes. I watch you YouTube that come here. Thank you. You can't throw it. Yeah, that's a good sign. They caught a nice one. I haven't had a, I've had a couple nibbles. It's weird on the other side of the ship, the current's going that way. Yeah, and it's opposite here. I can only imagine if you dove down here, the tackle you would find. I was fishing here. This exact spot this spring, a dude was right over there and he got snagged and he pulled up a whole fishing pole and it worked. Yeah? Yeah. And they say it don't rust until it comes out of the water. I was like, he, it's still spun and everything. He's like, well, I, that's a keeper in my book. <laughs> I was like, Well, folks, so far it's a pretty slow start to the morning. I fished all the spots on these first set of ships here. Didn't really even get a bite. I don't know, I'm gonna go try these other ships over here. Seems like right after I bounce it, this one I'll catch them. Well, that's the tall little guy. Well, that's what I'm after. Is it bigger? <laughs> there we go. Got you that time. Yeah, that's a nice one too. It's 15 and a half. I'll let you go. So let me get this hook out of here. Run out right there, folks. Pretty tall. There we go. It's a decent one too. I mean, that one's a keeper. Thirty. That's a nice dog there. Eighteen inches. That's definitely going in the cooler bag. Pretty one though. There we go. Got it. Neat. That was a nice one. He won't keep her though. I ain't mean, never seen a tog look like that. All right, hey folks, I've had enough of tog fishing for one day. It's been a slow day out here for them, that's for sure. I got one nice 18 inch keeper, probably the biggest one I've caught out here. I'm gonna go up here and try trout fishing for a while just to kill the last couple hours of the day, do something a little bit different. Anyway, that's what's up. Well, folks, I made it up here to the shore. Honestly, I'm not sure what I'm doing. Never fished here before. See all these boats over here. So there must be some fish out here. I am trolling a little quarter ounce behind me at least. Anyway, I don't know. I'm just going to kind of mosey on over here and see what's going on. No, well, I didn't take too long. This one was a keeper. I think I found me a little troll around out here and caught some, and I noticed I kept catching them in about the same area. So I'll circle back and started casting. And I've been on one every cast since. That's the advantage of trolling in a kayak. It's quiet. You can find the school. 
circle back and slay them. Little schooly size, but mm, don't seem to matter. Mm. Right inside the kayak. Alright, last cast. <laughs> well, alright folks, this is that time of day when it's starting to think about hitting home. Had a pretty slow day tog fishing. I did get one nice 18 incher and a few other shorts. I was very persistent. I swear I fished every square inch of those ships today. I think it's just a little bit too early. I mean, water temperature did get up to about 62 today, so I'm gonna troll a little bit longer watch this sunset and head on in and call it a day. Thanks for watching y'all. See you next time.